our Soul Calibre 5 launch here in London. Uh, we're really unlucky because Japan and America got it before us and already had their parties and so have France. So we've uh, hired out the Chapel Bar in London for uh, as many screens and games and consoles as we can and I encourage people to come down and have free play. So today we're only playing for pride. to travel a lot throughout Europe and stuff like that just to play fighting games and um, like competitively yeah competitively yeah it's been a big passion for me I mean I've been to Japan I've been to America I've been around Europe and France and stuff like that so the games a lot different for me it's like Soul Calibur has always been about two three, three hits for a combo now it's like 10 hits 15 hits you know it's quite expensive I mean I think it's they're trying to get into the market of like people like combos so I want to try and bring combos in so you know I'm impressed how they worked in because I mean from the Tekken standpoint, you know, everybody's like likes the juggles in Tekken. So to see that sort of thing in Soul Calibur and it works, then I'm quite impressed how it works. Games quite right, games runs really smoothly. I think it runs a lot better than Soul Calibur 4, definitely. It's I mean, I used to say oh this game's just like Soul Calibur 4, but now that I've played it, it's a lot different. It's definitely a lot more compelling, it's a lot more intriguing for me to play. Soul Calibur is like the one of the best beam ups, one of the best beam ups around. It's so accessible, you can easily get into it. And it's got a whole load of characters that you'll find someone that you'll love instantly. The fifth one is probably the best in the series. Uh, it's the most accessible, it gets you into it really easy, a nice big massive tutorial mode. It's got a nice long big class of characters. You've got Ezio if you don't like any of them, so you can always play as your so you can always play as your Assassin's Creed favourite man. So that's alright. So if you could have any guest character in the game, who would you have? Yeah, Bennett would be awesome for it. A complete over the top action, a hairs and a weapon that could turn into loads of different weapons, it's perfect. What would you say really stands out from this fighting game compared to the other fighting games? Um I'd definitely say like the artwork. I mean some other games have good artwork, but this just stands out of like the characters, like as you can see here. Um, all characters have different um, poses and it really like shows that they put detail into the artwork. When I was yeah, yeah. like looking through the customization, you can do so much for it. Yeah. And you, it's like you do one day just on one character, customizing them and it's, it's just the best thing about the game. Pretty much what you expect from Soul, uh, Soul Calibur 4, well, 5 from all the uh, advertisements so far. I mean, this is what the customization is all about, right? To make your dream girlfriend, right? A dream girl? Uh, probably not, because this dream girl is probably going to kill you if you look at them funny. Uh, they'll sword stab here and there. I see you've gone for the amalgamation of Tacky and a bit of Ivy. Obviously, you got Ivy there, and then you got Tacky everywhere else, the whole red. And you got a bit of Shang Tsui with the sword, I see. 1 out of 10, 10 being super hot, you would do anything for her. Um, what, how's your rating? Uh, I'm gonna be, I'm gonna be good and give you a seven. That's good. A seven. <laughs> What's missing? What's missing? Um, I think what it needs is an aura, an aura of something. You know, you need some. My favorite, personally, personally, my favorite color would be purple. If you give him like a purple something or other, you would be fine. You'd be bumpy up to a nine. Awesome. But no, seven, eight. Hey, actually, I'm gonna be generous. Give me an eight. No, there we go. An eight now. There we go. This is it. Apparently, it's got me out of a lot of tricky spots. Really? Side stepping. Yeah, yeah. When you do like the double step, it doesn't move you far enough away to actually dodge no, a lot. Like that way. Oh yeah. Or that way. Then. Oh, yeah. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. When you do. Your... Oh,